Alrighty, man. What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of the Real Hell Life series. And as you guys can see, man, we are your boy Franklin here today at his new mansion. But uh, I actually thought, man, we probably shouldn't sell the other mansion, considering you know, mainly because it's it's in the game, man. Franklin keeps that mansion regardless of if we keep it or sell it. You know what I'm saying? So I decided we'll go ahead and just hire some folks to go ahead and have it be a redone, a full renovation of that mansion. And it should be done today. You know what I'm saying? So we're gonna go ahead and go check that out in today's episode and uh yeah i do want to do some trapping today too so after we check out this mansion i'm gonna go to show you guys well i ain't even gonna show you nothing i'm gonna go ahead and get some trapping down that's what i'm going to do so yeah we're gonna go ahead and go look at this mansion because uh it, it, i ain't even gonna lie this whole renovation thing bro it makes the mansion look a ton better on the interior but the interior is completely changed i know you guys are gonna like this and we probably should pull up the mcdonald's first hey boy franklin wants some food so we'll probably go to McDonald's first real quick. Oh yeah, man. Hopefully you guys do enjoy the episode, man. Hopefully you guys do enjoy the episode, man. So let's go ahead and make our way down. See, I guess I'll go to set a waypoint to the Mickey D's. Got a mile, uh, 1.7 miles remaining until we get to our destination hill. Yeah, man. Uh, yesterday, I actually did post a Forza Horizon 4 video because I did say after the 15th, uh, all the other games were going to be coming back to the channel, so hopefully you guys did enjoy the Forza and uh, you know want that back. Cause I ain't even going to lie, bro. I was getting a decent amount of comments from people literally asking for just the Forza videos. Like out of any other game that I post that isn't GTA 5, Forza was the the next best thing that you guys were asking for. That that's that's kind of surprising. I ain't even going to lie, cause usually I never have anyone asking to watch some Forza. So now you know what I'm saying, man. Now I know I gotta stay consistent with the. Oh damn, I missed my turn. Now I know I gotta stay consistent with the Forza uploads, and I'm probably gonna get a build episode done today to go along with this GTA 5 video here. Plus I got another GTA 5. Actually, I don't know, bro. I got a lot of ideas now. Starting to get these ideas. Your boy Franklin about to buy a new thing of Bob in the next episode. I don't even wanna, ex I, like, I don't even wanna expose what it is. So we're going to go ahead and keep it on the DL for right now. But yeah, I want to definitely probably have Franklin go ahead and get that guy. I mean, not get that guy, but go ahead and buy this building. So you guys can go ahead and see what they do, man. But we're going to go ahead and get us some food. I think this, if I'm not mistaken, they have chicken nuggets, McNuggets at this damn McAdee's. So we're going to go ahead and get us some McNuggets. I ain't even gonna lie, man. In real life, I don't even eat those McNuggets, bruh. Like, I'd never, never go and order them McNuggets. I don't think I've ever ordered them ever. At least not for myself. I've never ordered them things for myself. They ain't even that bad. I just don't eat them. I don't know. I done heard so much bad shit about them McDonald's chicken nuggets. I just never eat them. And that's not even the reason why I don't even eat them. I just don't eat them. I don't like the nuggets. Well, I don't, it's not that I don't like them. I just don't eat the nuggets. All right, let me see. We're going to hit the drive through. I think they're going to have some. Let me see. They might have some McNuggets. They should have some McNuggets, goddamn. All right, let's see. Come on now. I think I pressed the wrong key. All right. Uh, oh, no. Nah, they ain't got no McNuggets, bruh. All right. Uh, see. A McJunior. What the hell is a McJunior? I ain't never seen no damn McJunior or McToast. I ain't never seen no McToast neither. Crispy McBacon. Double chicken barbecue. What the hell? You know, let's try the double chicken barbecue. All right, so we're gonna wait on that. All right, so that's here. Let's go to get the double cheeseburger too, just in case I don't like the double McChicken. All right, uh, and uh, the drink, and we'll get a milkshake. Alrighty, so now we done got our food. We good to go. Now, ain't gonna lie, we probably should have went and looked at the mansion first, cause now we gotta make this long ass drive back up here. But yeah, it's all good. But yeah, like I was saying, man, I think it'd be a better idea if Franklin went ahead and just kept this mansion instead of selling it, and instead of moving from it. I think he it'd be better if he kept it. And uh, you know what I'm saying? We we'll just we we'll just use this mansion too, cause we just renovated it now. There ain't no point in selling it. Well. Actually, it'll be a good idea to sell it after you renovate it, because then it'll be brand new with everything brand new. You'll be able to charge top dollar. Top dollar for the mansion? But, I, I, man, after we see it, you guys let me know in the comment section. After we see it, should we sell it or should we keep it? 
I kind of want to keep it, so I don't know, man. This is I, I guess I guess you guys will be the the tiebreaker or the deal breaker, should I say? Not the tiebreaker. Well, yeah, not the tiebreaker. It's too many of y'all. There, there probably would never be a tie. If I were to post a poll about this, there, there wouldn't be no tie. So yeah, the deal breaker, should I say? The deal breaker. All right, so let's go ahead and make our way down here. We got uh, almost a mile. I definitely want to get some trapping done. I want to see what, what we can make. Actually, I think we're full on drugs, so we're probably not even going to be pulling up on any plugs. We're probably going to ride around and just service some folks, because I forgot we are full on drugs. Like, our bag is completely full. Okay, cool. Completely forgot about that. All right, here we go. Three quarters of a mile remaining. I'm surprised we ain't been pulled over yet, but I done ran so many lights and stop signs. I've been speeding this whole time. We ain't been pulled over yet, bro. Like, come on now. Where the coppers at? Right, here we go, 0.4 miles. All right, here we go. We're almost there. We're driving this ZR1. We haven't drove this joint in a minute, bro. That's why I went ahead and decided to drive this guy for today. Oh, we probably about to move some of these cars into the garage too. Um, you know, I'm actually gonna go ahead and pop a save right here before we even get too close to the house. I don't want anything to glitch. All right, so let me go ahead and uh, here we can pull it up. I'm gonna probably put like two of these cars in the garage. There, there's no cars in the garage now that we're driving the damn Corvette. So we're probably gonna move the Crown Vic and the Tahoe into the garage. All right, but yeah, let me go ahead and, uh, I guess we can go into the interior now. I'm going to show you guys what we're working with. The new crib. So the garage is still the same. Y'all know. We ain't changing the garage. I believe most of this out. Ooh, peaky peaky. Whoa, we shouldn't have went that way. All right, let's go ahead in the front door. I'm going to show you guys what we're working with. I'm going to come out of first person. So here is the new crib. The renovated crib, man. Let me know what you guys think about it. I like the paint zining on lot. I like that one the most, but she over there smoking a blunt too. Okay, cool. Well, a joint, cause that 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 was some paper that she had it rolled up in. All right, but yeah. But we got red couches now. Okay, the boy went ahead and picked up the red couches. I like this, man. I like this. Let me know what you guys think about this crib right here. Or right, let me know what you guys think about the the renovation of the crib, cause this this really isn't even a new crib. It's just been renovated. What is this right here? This shit's actually kind of cool. I don't know why this caught my attention. It's kind of some cool shit right there. I like this, bro. I really like the, the change on this. I'm not sure if this was changed. Actually, I think it is changed because that right there does not look like it was there before. I think that is changed. Yeah, most of this is new. Yeah, you got yoga stuff out there. Yeah, most of this is new. I don't think uh, I don't think most of that was there. We still gotta go downstairs and check downstairs. Let's go to make our way downstairs. Go check downstairs real quick. Right, look at this, bro. I really like this wood look, bro. That shit looks good. Then it got the brick right here. That brick looks good too. The brick matches the wood, that, bro. This hallway looks ten times better. I wish I can go in this door. I think there is a mod that allows me to go into these doors. So I'm actually go back and see if I can refine that because I think I've seen it. But I didn't do anything with it because I, I, I didn't think it was worth it. I'm going to actually go ahead and try that out though. But this is cool as hell, bro. I'm going to look for some more uh, interior changing mods like this. This is cool as hell. Oh, okay. All right. I like that. That's a cool ass little painting right there. Bro, look at this, bro. The room's ten times better. Everything looks hella better. See, we ain't got the garage no more. I'm gonna see if I can find another uh, another extension mod for another, a different garage. We'll go ahead and have Franklin have a, a whole different garage uh, back here. Oh, I can't. Okay. Yeah, I can't. Okay. I can't. Okay. So yeah, I don't think anything was out here was changed. It was all interior, so. You know what I'm saying? It was just a whole renovation of the interior chop. Oh my. I gotta train your ass to use the John chop. Bro, we just caught this man. 
My man's just taking the shit right now. All right. But yeah, man, definitely let me know what you guys think about the renovation. We're going to go ahead and pay for the renovation right now. I guess we'll go ahead and pay about... Maybe we'll pay... What would be a good... I'd say 300000 It'd be a good price because, you know, this is a whole little mansion right here. It got completely renovated. Completely changed. Oh, damn. Bruh, I didn't, I didn't know this was here. Hey, that was the painting that I seen. Well, these paintings are damn high quality as shit. That, that looks real good. I like that. I like that. All right, so let's go ahead and get some trapping done. We just spent three hundred thousand dollars. Need to go ahead and make us some money. Need to go ahead and make us some guala, some paper, some chatter. Well, first we gotta move these cars in the garage. But we ain't drove that Silverado in a minute, but we don't had that guy parked right there for days. We'll probably drive that out to uh, Sandy Shores when we're going. Yeah, when we're going by this camper, we'll probably drive that out there. Tahoe right here. For once it ain't us, dog. For once it ain't us, dog. Alright, let's go ahead and move the uh, Crown Vic into the garage now. Oh, we ain't drove this Crown Vic in a minute either, but we bought this guy and drove it for like one episode, I think. Oh, I didn't even think we drove it yet. Yeah, we're gonna. Oh, no, we did drive. We did. I remember now. Okay. I need to go get it washed. Joint dirty. Dirty, dirty. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, let's do some trapping. Start pulling up on some folks. We done looked at a whole renovated crib. Had to move two of my whips in the driveway. All right, we got one bag of P.O. going to Rockford Hills. I probably should go ahead and, um, probably should go ahead and move that, uh, the GLE. So it's not blocking the charger. But uh, we probably won't even draw that charger for a minute. So shoot, bump. Here we go, 0.6 miles. Let's go to make our way on down here to drop off this one bag of peyote. Peyote? And we need those cells that's gonna be like three, four, five bags, man. Man, I, I can't wait till we probably get that first set of like, do want 10 bags or something. That'd be a crazy little sale, bro. We make real guala. Real paper, cheddar cheese. All right, man, we got a quarter mile remaining. Ooh, we, oh, okay, damn, okay. Corvette got some juice. You know, like, I do like driving this Corvette a lot, bro. We just don't drive it no more. It's like ever since I did that drag racing episode, I think that drag racing episode was the last episode where I drove it. So we about to have Franklin drive most of the cars he already owns before we start buying more cars now. This right, so is gonna make this sell real quick. Make some cheddar, make some guala, make some paper, paper. I know we're probably only about to make like a hundred dollars, two hundred dollars. Cool, cool. There we go, seven bags of LSD going to the university campus. Let's go to take these uh these delinquents, their their drugs. Should be in class learning. Instead, you're waiting on the plug to pull up with some LSD. Ain't that some shit? I'm, I'm probably going to have to figure out what's up with my cops because I haven't seen a single cop in a while. And that's kind of surprising because usually, man, y'all know my cops be around. They be patrolling. Alright. Let's go to make this sale real quick. This is about to be at least $1,000. Or at least, well, actually, it should be like three, $4,000. Yep. It was actually five. Five bands for the oh seven bags of crack won the Chamberlain Hills. Now I know this is only about to be like probably Whoa shit. Damn dude. But yeah, I know this is probably about to only be like what three, four hundred dollars probably. You know, this crack don't go too high, man. You know what I'm saying? Crack don't go too high. Crack pretty cheap. All right, so we go, man, 1.5 miles remaining. I'm going to go ahead and just speed this. Since we ain't got to deal with the cops, man, I'm about to just go ahead and speedy Gonzalez. You know what I'm saying? Speedy Gonzalez. 
Woo! Woo! Oh shit, I just dropped over some dude's truck. Damn. There's a car right here. Oh my no. Did we kill him? I think we oh yeah, we gotta go. Oh wait, he turned what we hit my man's and he going wow we hit my man's he ended up on the other side of the road and just continued driving like nothing ever happened true warrior right there most of these folks they would have got out and called 12. <laughs> ain't got time ain't got time gonna need to get some gas too i guess we could stop and get some gas before we pull up on this dude let me see where's the gas tank at left side Let's fill up the tank. All right, there we go, man. I gotta go ahead. See, we gotta hit up a Los Santos Customs now. Gotta get my bumper and hood uh, fixed up, cause that's a no bueno right there, man. That's a no bueno. Yo, girl. All right, we got half a mile. Hey, man. No, no, you. Ah, all right. Have a mile left until we reach our customer over here in Chamberlain Hills. I think he might be at that store. Yeah, I think he at that store. That's why my man's chilling, waiting on me at. Let me go through here. You are like you can't call nobody. Here we go, crazy driving nuke. Um, Oh, it's a female too, but she looked like she do crack. Oh man. Oh man. That's not cool. But look, look. Oh man. All right. See, seven hundred dollars. That wasn't even. wasn't really too much, but it's all good. Two. Okay. See, two mushrooms going out there. I don't think we're gonna do that trip. So we're gonna cancel that. We're gonna find another trip to do. I'm finna head to Los Santos Customs. It's like right down the street down here. Unless we get a good sale. See one bag of MDMA to Rockford Hills. That's not really a good sale. So uh, yeah, we're going to keep going. I'm going to reset it again. Trying to get us some good money, man. One bag of meth going to Bumbling. All right, we're going to reset again. I'm going to reset until we get us some good deals. Um, you know, mainly because, okay, see now that's an okay deal. Four bags of meth to the outside of the Mega Mall. Especially since the Mega Mall isn't too far away. So let's go ahead, let's just uh, fix the whip up real quick since we're right here by this Los Santos Customs. Whee! Ooh, boy, we just did 130 in my new COVID. I'm gonna install the uh, the mileage mod so we can see how many miles we put on cars and stuff. That'd actually be pretty, uh, pretty fine. Right, hundred dollar repair. There we go. And let's go to make our way down. All right, we got one point one miles until we reach our destination here. Got my Corvette fixed up. I ain't gonna lie, that crash with some cheese though. No cap, man. That, ca that crash with some cheese. All right, three quarters of a mile remaining. All right, we got half a mile now. Let's go ahead and make this sell. Uh, I guess this may be the last sell that we'll go ahead and do. You know what I'm saying? We made some made some decent money. I may go ahead and change the paint job on this Corvette too. Maybe that time to go ahead and get this green changed out for something else. So if you guys have any color suggestions, leave them in the comment section down below as well. And here we go at the Mega Mall. Hey man. Hey man, what's up? I ain't gonna lie, this car, this car is just too low for speed bumps in my opinion. Like, I feel like, I feel like going over a speed bump in this car is just gonna cause damage. Like, I, I think in real life it's kinda, no, I know in real life you can go over speed bumps without a problem. But, I don't know man. All right, but with that being said, man, $400 right there. With that being said, man, hopefully you guys did enjoy this episode of the Brilliant Hill Life series. 
If you guys did, make sure you guys drop a like down below. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Make sure you guys follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter. Links are in the description down below. And I will catch you guys in the next episode or live stream, man. Peace on out.